I'm Maria Lizignoli. Thanks for joining us. An addiction recovery clinic on East Washington in Madison will close its doors at the end of the week. Now, staff says they are scrambling to prepare themselves and their patients on such short notice. NBC 15's Colton Molesky spent the day talking with employees about what they call a really sudden move. Colton. Maria, this is the message that appears when you go to the Monarch Health Addiction Recovery Clinic's website. The thank you note alerts people to the clinic's imminent closure on Friday. To change the clinic, staff was notified about just a handful of days ago on May 12th. A very big shock to a lot of our clients. A clinic that helps people with mental health concerns and addiction recovery is closing on Friday. Back on May 10th, the staff was told everything was fine. And the owners were pretty positive about the outlook of the clinic and to, told staff not to be worried about what was going on. And then we received an email saying that we were going to be meeting on um, Friday the 12th. Service facilitator Kelsey South says the Friday meeting is when staff was notified the clinic would close in just two weeks without an explanation as to why. From then on, it has been a race to alert hundreds of patients about the switch and attempt to set up a new place for care. This location is prime location because it's right downtown. It's on the bus line. It's within walking distance from the beacon, which is right across the street. Um, the women's shelter, the Salvation Army, is right down East Wash. South says one suggested clinic to transfer patients is in Middleton, but many patients do not have access to cars and are staying in shelters on the east side. A lot of days within the last week or so, we've had a lot of patients come in yelling and upset because they were given less than a week's notice. Janine Bell was a medical assistant for Monarch Health until her termination Monday. She says DHS was in the building investigating patient complaints. Bell says she was terminated later in the day without explanation just days before the clinic closes. It's not fair for the patients. To see clients that are really ups upset, understandably so, because they're losing their supports um, and just worried about if, you know, they might go into relapse or if they'll um, get really sick from not having the medications that they need. Now I did call Monarch and left my contact information for the owners last week, but I did not hear back from them. I also reached out to DHS about the investigation. Multiple employees have told me about, but did not get a response. In studio, Colt Molesky, NBC 15 News.